Today, I'm going to show you how to record in Rec Room for every platform. There are four methods you can use, and you can use them to get crazy camera angles like this. Method 1 is the streamer cam. This is a camera that can be moved around and get different shots. You can set up points for the streamer cam to go to with the maker pen. Here's how. To spawn one in, you'll just bring out your watch, backpack, use, grab it, let's go to create, palette, go on search, we'll just type in streamer cam. We have this right here. Then we can just place this. Now, say we move this up quite a bit. Now, when we change our view, we're going to get the view as this. You can also get different views with your streamer cam, such as handheld, handheld backwards, follow, face, POV, and streamer points that we just set up. For the video settings, you have frame rate. Field of view, green screen, light intensity, and light range. From audio settings, you have hear from the player, or hear from streamer cam, and voice mixer. Now the streamer cam will not actually record for you. Whatever view it has will show up on your screen, and you must use a screen recorder to get it. The standard is to use OBS, which is free and does not have any watermarks or paid features. The one problem with streamer cam is that it is only for PC users or Quest users who have AirLink. You can also use it on screen mode if you have two monitors. Alright, now method two is simply recording your POV. Simply recording your POV is the most common way to record your videos. You get to show yourself playing the game through your own view. You can also do it for every platform. You can also record yourself with a mirror. You can also record with a camera. I'll link the tutorials for all the platforms in the description below. Method three, holotars. Believe it or not, you can use a holotar to act out and then just record with your POV or anything else you want. It can also be good to have two different angles. What you're going to do is you're going to go backpack, maker pen, create, palette. Then you're just going to search up holotar. Click on here, right here, and spawn it in. Next, you can move it wherever you want. I'm just going to put it at four here. And then what you're gonna do is you're gonna press the record button. And you're gonna act out your lines and we'll do it right now. Hi, I'm Puddle Pro, and this is the top 10 serials. When you're happy with what you made, click save, and then it's done. We can make it even more realistic if we go configure, that, and then hide projector. Next, we'll search up button. you're gonna need the button V1 legacy. Just spawn that in. Then you're gonna to go to tools, wire, and you're gonna do this green one back here to the red one up here. Now, whenever I press this button, it'll play my recording. And we'll just press it and get in location. Hi, I'm Puddle Pro, and this is the top 10 serials. And there you go. All right, finally for method four, recording account. Now this is my favorite method that I use most of the time, is to have a second account record for you. What this means is that you make a new account with your laptop, computer, PlayStation, or Xbox, then record yourself. So as long as you have two systems that can run Rec Room, I highly recommend this method. But if you wanna do this, you need to turn off your HUI in the settings. This will take away the dot in the middle of the screen and other graphics just to be sure that it's only your view. Next, you want to turn off head bobbing all the way down to zero. Finally, turn off all notifications. This will make it so the view is perfect for recording. All you need to do is go to create, palette, and search up seat. Then spawn in the seat and search up animation gizmo. Now go to the tools, then wire, and wire the seat to the animation gizmo. Then you can animate the seat to do whatever you want. Then just have your account sit in the chair, and you can get cool shots like this.
If you haven't already, subscribe.